Hello students, in this video we will discuss about the projections of planes when the plane is parallel to VP and perpendicular to HP. Okay. In the question it is given a regular pentagon ABCDE of side 30 mm is parallel to VP. Okay. And if it is parallel to VP obviously it will be perpendicular to HP. The side AB of the plane or lamina is perpendicular to HP. So we have to adjust the plane such that side AB is perpendicular to HP. Draw its projections. Okay. Let us start drawing. One edge of the polygon, one edge of the pentagon, it is equal to 30 mm. So since it is regular, all the sides or all the edges of the pentagon will be equal, right? So let us start drawing. For this, let us draw the XY line first. Let us take it to be 60. Now, we will go to polygon command, go to polygon command. The number of sides, it is equal to 5, since it is a pentagon. Go to edge method, right? Go to edge method. So, let us just click over here because side AB is perpendicular to HP, right? So this is equal to 30. One side is equal to 30 mm. My ortho is on. I have to make sure ortho is on. So we just need to enter 30. Okay, right 30 and press enter or in case you do not want to do this like it, what you can do? Let us turn off ortho mode. So you can also write as at the rate 30 less than 270. Because I am drawing a vertical line which is at the angle of 270 degree. So press enter. So this is the pentagonal lamina or plane which is parallel to VP and perpendicular to HP. Let us move this projection line downwards right so increase the line weight for the reference line let us make it 0 0.50 increase the line weight for the projection or you can say the front view make it 1 mm ok go to multi line text command So here we follow a rule that we draw that view first in which we are able to see the actual shape of the object. So actual shape was visible in the front view. So I have drawn the front view first. Let me equal to 4.5 and then times new Roman. This will be a dash. You can name it as a dash. This is A dash. Control C, Control V. So here A dash and B dash will be this vertical line because side AB is perpendicular to HP. Therefore, this should be this vertical line should be A dash B dash. So this is C dash. This is D dash. And this is E dash. This is E dash. Control V. Let us make it as capital X. Capital Y. Now 
now with the projections of the front view we will be able to draw the top view also so let us draw vertical projection lines from all the visible corners to be like this and then again from D also since the distance from HP and VP is not given to you so you can take any distance okay so the projection from B dash and A dash will be in the same line because these are in the same line C dash and E dash will be on the same line okay let us draw a horizontal line over here from here let us draw let us increase the line weight make it 1 mm okay then let us trim this these extra projection lines let us write t r and press enter twice delete this or trim this now let us mark points also go to p type press enter take this as the point now go to multiple points command over here let us mark the points first point second point and then third point now while i am naming this press control v this will be equal to a b because when I am viewing it from the top, A will be visible first and then B will come. So it will be AB. Then next is, this will be equal to EC. I will name it as EC. Again because E is visible first then comes C. So it will be EC. and then this will be D right so this is the solution to this question let us do the dimensioning also linear dimensioning this is equal to 30 mm one edge is equal to 30 mm so Please note down that we have drawn this in the first quadrant only. Okay, the projections of planes cannot be drawn in the second and fourth quadrant. So either you can draw it in the first quadrant or you can draw it in the third quadrant. So this we have drawn it in the first quadrant. Thank you very much.